Hey guys, free pick time. All right, back with another free play. Uh, we are coming off multiple free play wins. We are now 92 wins and 53 losses on the year. 92 and 53 on the year. Absolutely crushing it. Um, coming off a very profitable all-star break. Hope you guys had some good time off there. Um, got a player prop for you guys today. Now, our player props, um, we're in the midst of a little bit of a statistical anomaly um, what you might call variance, all right? We are 43 wins and seven losses in our last 50 player props, okay? I'm gonna say that again. 43 wins and seven losses in our last MLB, I should say, in our last MLB, in our last 50 MLB player props. Now, um, is Bender that good? Am I literally hitting 86% on my player props? Like, really? No. Okay, there is variance involved in this 1,000%, all right? Um, the expectation going forward is not that we are going to hit 85% or 86%. Um, it is the exact same way that, you know, we go on a little bit of a downturn, okay? We, we have a losing week. We have a losing month. And I tell you guys, look, chin up. We found value in these games, but we are experiencing what? variance, right? That is something you cannot control in sports betting. You can't control in poker. You can't control in gambling or anything to do with numbers, really. So in those cases, I would say, guys, don't worry about it. You know, we're going to, we're going to get the wins as long as we keep finding value. I will say that, look, I do a good job finding value on player props. That being said, we're not going to be hitting 85, 86%, but we are on a run. Um, today, guys, we're getting right back into, okay, we got uh, we got a lot of CFL. Um, we got some WNBA. We have baseball and we have quite a few baseball props as well. I'm going to give one prop to you guys. And in that particular game, I have three props. I have three player props in one game. Um, I think there's a pretty good edge there. Uh, prop I'm going to give to you guys. We are going to go uh, with Miami. Pablo Lopez over five and a half strikeouts, minus 130, minus 132 range. So we got to pay a little bit of juice there, but we factor that in when we are interpreting the value of the game. Now, in this particular spot, my projection is for him to get 7.3 to 7.5 strikeouts in and around that range. All right. Which would be, again, over his pace for the year, but I do think this is a good spot for him. Okay. So 7.3 to 7.5 strikeouts. That gives us a pretty nice edge, up around about a 20% edge, which is very, very nice, even when you factor in the minus 130. Now, where I would start to identify value when you're paying juice around minus 130 would be up around, you know, the 6.2 to 6.4 range, okay? If my projection was 6.2 to 6.4, paying minus 130, I would start to think there's a little bit of value. The fact that my projection is, you know, he's going to get 7.3, 7.5, there's good value there. Um, Benderwins.com, guys, for my full card. As I mentioned, um, we're on a tear on player props. That's really the only thing we can say about it. We're on an absolute tear. Um, we just crushed the home run derby. Uh, we got the maximum, absolute maximum result we could get. The only game we lost out of all the plays, the only game we lost out of all of them was Schwarber. And we were happy to lose that one because we had Soto to win it. At plus 600, okay, Schwerber was plus 330. We bet two people to win it, okay? The rest were all matchups and props and overs and unders, etc. And we won everything, literally everything we bet. Um, and we were happy with Soto because Soto paid six to one and we had a huge day and um, it was a lot of fun. One of my favorite events of the year. I do not know why. I just, maybe it's the fact that like I finally have like a couple days kind of off where I can chill and relax because... Before, traditionally, the day before and the day after the MLB All-Star break are traditionally the days where there's nothing to bet on. WNBA gave us a couple opportunities here and there, but um, I, I love the Home Run Derby and it did, us, uh, it did us well this year. So that is our play for today, guys. Again, full card at BenderWins.com. It's $99 a month, guys, for $3 a day. Um, we have been absolutely on fire across the board. So, you know... Um, wild absolute wild month um last 30 days have been crazy everything props baseball you know wnba cfl you name it right now it's clicking so uh, if you're interested benderwins.com um back again with another free play tomorrow guys let's hit that like button please much appreciated